I go to the movies. Yeah. And uh, this one, it was the foreign movie. And it had the words at the bottom. But it was not from Spain, like the ones I had been seeing. Nope. This one is from the Far East. I believe Japan. And um, I saw this at the Ragtag Cinemas. And uh, apparently this movie is getting all the nominations and awards and stuff like that. So I went to see it. And the movie it is called Here's My Car. Drive It Around. Drive my car. That's how it goes. And, um... It was long. <laughs> I saw another movie from the Far East. It was a documentary, and that one was like three hours long. I didn't look at the run time of this, but it was super long. It felt super long. It was so slow. It was a drama. And I... I thought, I thought, uh, I thought it was pretty good, you know, the acting, the emotions, especially getting near the end, you know, because it's like the main character, he's kind of emotionally walled off, then, you know, later he, he accepts his emotions, that sort of thing. It's interesting because he's an actor, you know, and so it's his job to display emotions, but then in his real life. He's kind of walled off. <coughs> so I thought that was kind of interesting. And, uh, he, like, he's doing this, like, experimental theater thing where he's, like, the director, and he was acting earlier in the movie, then he's, like, directing a, a thing where it's, like, all the characters are speaking a different language. And then they put subtitles of all the different languages, you know, up above the play. It's like, that's really interesting. I don't know. I've never seen a, a play like that or whatever. But it's kind of an interesting idea. And one of the people, they were doing Korean Sign Language, which was interesting. And it was like, a lot of it. It didn't seem to have anything to do with American Sign Language at all. Except for... They used the word drug. And... For morphine. Which I was like... I don't know if there's a separate... Sign in ASL for morphine. I haven't seen it. <laughs> so I was like... That was the same sign. I was like... Oh! <laughs> uh, but... Yeah, so it's like... If you watch the trailer... It's about the guy, and he has a, a wife, and she becomes dead, and it's sad. So there's that. That is part of it. And then, uh, I don't know if it really talks about it in the, in the trailer, but he ends up getting, like, a chauffeur lady. There's, like, this whole reasoning behind why it happens, you know. And, uh, you know, so then she's kind of in his life, that sort of thing. But, uh, I thought the movie, I thought it was well acted. I thought everybody did, did a good job. It being in a different language didn't, um, take away from my enjoyment of it, you know? It was kind of weird because some some uh, one of the characters is like speaking English in the play. And they don't do the subtitles for that. Mm. <laughs> but I was just like, oh, that's it's kind of interesting. And then I I didn't understand why some of the words were in parentheses when a certain person would talk. But I think they're signifying that this person's speaking a different language than the other one. But you know, they had to do subtitles for both the languages because neither of them are English. <laughs> so I, I found a card and I was like, why is this in parentheses? I didn't understand. <laughs> but it wasn't too big of a deal. But yeah, 
Right? It's, uh... <laughs> it was... It was super long. It felt so long. <laughs> but, it, I mean, they did a good job. It's just kind of like... I don't know if it would have been better as, like, a miniseries where you split them up. It was weird because it was like the credits happened again, like, halfway through. So I don't know if this is, like, two episodes or something. They made into a movie or... I don't know. But, um... Yeah. So... <laughs> I mean, I don't really know what else to say about it. Other than it was good, but it was super long. And there's, like, some interesting concepts. Like, this whole thing... There's this running story where... In the beginning of the movie where his wife is like telling him the story and then she forgets it so he has to tell it back to her you know and there's reasons Ooh. Ooh. oh oh an embarrassing human moment was caught on the film yeah and there's reasons you know they explain throughout the movie i don't want to give anything away regarding any of that but it's like that's kind of interesting too it was just it was like there's a whole lot of There's there's a whole lot going on in this. There's a whole bunch of different, you know, parts and relationships and stuff all intertwining. That's kind of cool. It was just, I don't know, maybe some of it could have been shaved in some way. Shaved off the story, but I don't know. I thought it was pretty pretty good movie. But anyway, I'm just rambling on, saying the same things over and over. So... <laughs> And as always, you know, that's just my opinion. And my opinion doesn't matter. And your opinion doesn't matter. And that dog that's barking over there, his opinion doesn't matter. It's just, uh, we just put our opinions on the internet, you know? It's what we do as a culture. No one knows why we do it, but we can't seem to stop. So, those are my thoughts and opinions to be thrown on top of the thoughts and opinions pile. Soon to be buried by everybody else's. But, uh, for what it's worth, I thought the movie was, it was good, but it was long. <laughs> but I thought they did a good job. So, yeah.